Hey guys, Steve here, and in today's video, I'm going to show you exactly how to set up your very own AI agent inside Claude for your SEO content creation. Okay, this is going to be a full tutorial taking you step by step from actually creating the agent to going ahead and then generating content with that agent. Okay, so let's take a look. So right now I'm inside Claude. You will need the uh, Claude Pro subscription to do this, by the way. Um, it won't work on the, the normal plan. Um, and you click on projects, so it's create a personal project here. So Claude projects are a really, really awesome way. In my opinion, they're better than uh, ChatGPT custom GPTs, but we'll see, we'll talk a little bit about that later on. So what are you working on? So we're just gonna name our project here. So I'm gonna say um, AI SEO, AO, SEO, AO. AI SEO agent. Okay, and this is going to be our agent. And now we're going to basically tell um, Claude Projects what we're trying to achieve with this agent. Okay, describe your project. What are the goals of this agent? The subject matter, um, the areas they're going to be operating in, etc. Okay. So what we want for this is I want a basically a clone of me. I want a personal assistant that's going to go away and do various different SEO activities but in the way that I would do them. For example, content creation in my own voice, that type of thing, okay? So I'm gonna to go to my uh, my prompts here. So this is my agent prompt. So my prompts here are fairly long, okay? So I'm gonna go ahead and um, copy and paste this in. And by the way, you can get all the prompts I'm using in today's tutorial if you sign up for the Next Gen AI newsletter below in the description, okay? You'll get everything you see today and all my past prompts too. I'm gonna to paste this in here, all right? Now, if we want to read through this a little bit, okay? So essentially, we're giving the agent a personality and identity. So I'm saying to the agent, you're my personal SEO and marketing assistant designed to help me create, optimize, and manage content that authentically represents my voice and brand. Your primary goal is to combine SEO best practices with my personal communication style to create content that ranks well whilst maintaining authenticity, okay? Really, really important, okay? And what I found is with these agents, the more specific you are, the more context you give, the better uh, the outcome. So I've given it a list of core responsibilities and also a working style and then also key outcomes as well. So again, it's quite a lengthy prompt, but if you wanna go through it yourself, obviously feel free to um, to get the document by signing up for the newsletter below, okay? So that's that. So we're basically, we've given our agent um, context. So we're gonna click Create Project. And we can see right here, so our agent's created and um, we can then prompt our agent from here, but we don't wanna do that just yet, okay? There's a couple more things that we wanna do here to complete this agent. First of all, we wanna give it a set of project instructions, and then we also wanna give it knowledge. And what I mean by knowledge is that we wanna upload uh, materials that I've used in the past so it can go ahead and capture the style of which I work. But also project instructions are really important too, so let's do that first of all. And let's click on project instructions here on the right. Yeah, and basically it's saying to provide Claude with relevant instructions and information for chats with your agent, okay? And it's given some kind of um, stock examples here, right, of what he wanted to do. But once again, of course, I have a, a lengthy prompt um, with custom instructions, okay? So this is basically like we're telling Claude how we want it to operate, like what the output is going to, or the end result is going to be, okay? So I've given it um, some custom instructions on writing style and tone, uh, readability requirements, um, prohibited. Okay, so this is really important, right? I don't want any of the content or the output out there to have any of these kind of dead giveaway AI buzzwords, you know, things like um, in today's digital world or transformation and things like that, okay? Readability requirements, eight grade reading, use short paragraphs, break up the text, etc. So basically we're giving it as much um, kind of custom instructions as possible. And then for content creation outlines, um, you know, start with a clear engaging hook always. And then it's basically um, tell them how to SEO optimize, okay? Uh, we wanna include LSIs and entities, structure the headers, to do quality checks, and then uh, format response and also technical specifications. So meta descriptions, keeping it under 155 characters, etc. Okay. So this is pretty extensive, right guys? So this is basically going to be my project instructions. I want to see output like this. So we're going to go ahead and give the agent these instructions and then we're going to click save. Awesome. 
So we've given the agent an identity and it's also got instructions. So right now, the only thing we're missing is actually some referral material that this agent can, can kind of rely upon to produce future content, okay? And if you click on add content here, you can upload content from a device or you can uh, do it from your drive or you can simply copy and paste. And I think like it depends on the, um, so I'm gonna copy and paste an article I wrote before on gardening and I'm simply going to add this content, add text content, uh, gardening blog, and then paste it in here and click add the content, okay? Now, this blog here um, is taking up 2% of knowledge capacity, okay? So you've got a lot more room to add extra context in there. And this will take pretty much anything, okay? And what I'd recommend doing, I would recommend taking like your website materials, um, even taking things like copy and pasting your LinkedIn profile or even downloading into a PDF, um, any kind of, you know, just any content out there you have, right? Social media posts, uh, podcasts, blog posts you've written in the past, even email newsletters, anything that's gonna give um, this agent more of an identity, okay, more um, referral materials, because we, we want it to be an extension of you, or in this case, an extension of me, okay? But just for the purposes of this tutorial to save some time, I'm just gonna leave the gardening blog there right now, okay? So what we're gonna do is we're gonna follow this up, yeah? We wanna create a blog now, or we're gonna ask this agent to create us um, a piece of SEO content. So once again, I'm gonna go to my blog post uh, prompt, and this is relatively small compared to the other prompts because we've already given it a lot of the things it needs. And I'm gonna ask it to create an SEO optimized blog post for the keyword best gaming chairs 2024, okay? With the final word count of around 2,500 words. And it, this should then follow the instructions and produce this article in the same style as the gardening article. So let's take a look at this now and see what it produces. Okay, and Claude has finished writing that. And as we can see, it's come up with best gaming chairs, 2024, your ultimate guide to gaming comfort, okay? Um, and it's given us an introduction here. And I, I really like this um, introduction because none of the AI buzzwords there, we've just got nothing kills a gaming session faster than an aching back. Very true, right? And I'm looking at my chair uh, here as I read that, okay? Why trust this guide? What's new in gaming chairs? And then top gaming chairs, and it does a comparison. It's got some prices and things like that. Um, continue with the uh, detailed buying sections for each category, okay? Um, so what we can do is we can actually extend this uh, blog post out because I would say this is more kind of um, um, an outline for the content strategy. Yeah, and even Claude here says it's the outline as well. So I think uh, maybe I did have some outline instructions in, in here, but yeah, you can see kind of see um, what you've got and then we can extend, expand each of these sections as Claude is suggesting, okay? So you can see you can get real, real quality output um, with Claw or with this AI agent just by giving it some real thorough prompts in both the uh, uh, instructions and also uh, the, the project goals, what this agent hopes to achieve. Giving an identity, giving it a personality, and then giving these instructions. So then, then go and use this AI agent for pretty much anything related to SEO. It's always gonna do it in my style, all right? So hopefully you can see how easy it is to actually um, set up these uh, Claude projects or uh, Claude agents, if you will. And uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to um, to doing more of these um, in different kind of niches, different verticals, different kind of tasks. And I, I just think AI agents are absolutely exploding right now. Um, so it's, you know, you, you need to learn how to do them. You need to learn how to use them effectively or you're just gonna get left behind, all right? So whilst we're on the topic of uh, content creation, um, obviously I love Claude um, and I'm definitely gonna be using AI agents moving forward. But if you want a completely automated way to generate your SEO content and even do keyword research as well, I'm using a really awesome platform called Journalist AI. Um, it's a complete all-in-one AI SEO suite. Um, it doesn't just write, it auto blogs. Also, it's got some really awesome features about uh, tracking keywords as well. So I'm inside the dashboard for this now. You can see it's really, really easy. You can generate SEO articles in one click. AI news articles, Amazon affiliate product reviews, if you're an affiliate marketer, even YouTube to blog posts, okay? And if I wanted to create a blog post, I just simply put a keyword, a title, and then add keywords. And I can add a few more if I want to there. Depends on how many blog posts I want to write. Or I can import a CSV of uh, keywords I've researched and then upload them to the blog, okay? That's really, really easy. Um, I'm just gonna go show you um, an example of um, an article it generated before for me. Um, let's go with, I love this bacon bread article just because it always makes me hungry. And uh, I haven't had some sourdough in quite a while, okay? And honestly, guys, this platform is awesome, right? So we've got the, let me edit it with AI. 
So it generates the table of contents, of course, the introduction, uh, key takeaways, formats it completely SEO optimizes it, okay? And one of the reasons why this is really good is it's a real auto blogger. So it adds images um, generated by AI, it adds YouTube videos, relevant YouTube videos based on the keyword. It even puts things into tables, um, does like little notes like this, it even adds external and internal links on autopilot, okay? and. One thing we can do is we can actually change each section using AI. I can actually write, rewrite this however which way I want, make it into a table, make it longer, etc. add additional keywords, and this is really awesome. Also add some uh, additional links if I wanted to, okay? So this is a massive time saver from going out there and researching links and go bang, bang, and there we've got, we've got some links in there, okay? Um, as well as, you know, a full kind of AI SEO suite, we've got this really cool feature called uh, Feeds, which I absolutely love, and what this does it, um, you enter in some of your competitors' URLs, and this basically sets up a feed, and every 48 hours it refreshes, and then gives you um, keywords that your competitors are using with the volume and the difficulty. And what I've actually done, I've actually set this up to the auto-blogging feature, so that any time a new keyword comes in from a competitor, I automatically produce and publish a piece of content on that keyword, right? It's like, it's just stealing traffic, essentially. It's like a cheat code. I absolutely love it, right, guys? So Journalist AI, if you want to try it out, you get three free articles and you get to try out the platform simply for entering in your email address. There's no payment information. There's no credit card required. So if you go through my link below, you get the three free articles. And if you do decide to upgrade in the future and join the platform, you'll get my exclusive discount as well, okay? I can't be fairer than that. But hopefully you enjoyed this video on Claude AI Agents. And if you want to do some SEO as well, get Journalist AI too. And I'll see you on the next one. Thank you very much.